What is up everybody? Patrick here. I hope you all are having a wonderful day. Today we're going to look over six apps or websites that I use every single day to make money online as a broke teen. The first site I really like is Swagbucks and Swagbucks is just a get paid to site which means you do simple tasks to get paid online. And I'm pretty sure it's one of the oldest and most popular get paid to sites. The best part about Swagbucks are the Discover offers, which are offers that just pay you to sign up. So for example, uh, one of the Discover offers had me sign up for Hulu. They paid me $25 to sign up for Hulu, and it only costed me like, I think, it only costed me $6 for the month. So that was a $19 profit right there. I literally got paid to watch Rick and Morty. Imagine that. The second website I use is CrowdTap, which is a microsurvey platform. And basically that just means that instead of getting these full-blown surveys, you get these little one-question surveys. You get around like 30 questions every day and they're really easy to blow through. And th this nets me about $5 every month. But I really don't have to try with this, it's really simple. Next we have a website called Prolific. Now Prolific is one of my favorite survey sites and that's because the surveys are actually interesting. Prolific gives you academic surveys and many times these surveys will be on the subject of psychology and when the survey is actually interesting, imagine or not, time flies by when you're doing it. Not only that, they pay well. The minimum payment they give is like $6.50 per hour and it goes up to like $10 per hour and even more if you get lucky. And a very important thing to mention with uh, these survey sites is that on Prolific, you never get disqualified, which if you have ever taken surveys, getting disqualified is literally the most annoying thing because you went through the effort and work to, you know, complete the survey and get some pennies just to get disqualified. But yeah, Prolific only gives you surveys that you qualify for, so you don't have to worry about that. The next site I use is Pinecone Research. And Pinecone Research is another survey panel. So all their surveys, at least for me, are 15 minute surveys that pay $3. And each one of these surveys is over the topic of food. So I get really hungry doing these surveys. That's the one annoying thing. And they like prolific, you don't get disqualified from these surveys. The really cool thing with Pinecone Research is that I've actually received free food from them like free food that's not even on the market yet they just want me to test it and give my feedback on so getting free food is a big plus highly recommend it as with all these sites moving on the next app is Ubdi, and Ubdi is a super new app with only 7200 members so far and basically what Ubdi wants to do is to give you back control of your data and in taking control of your data you're able to sell it right the surveys they give you pay incredibly well, uh, ranging from like a dollar to five dollars. They take less than a minute. It's usually a, it's usually like a question or two. The longest survey I have had on there took me two minutes, but it paid five dollars. So to get into more detail, basically how it works is you get this little survey. You answer the like one, two, three questions, and say the survey wants like your information on Instagram. So you hand that over too, and you get paid for that. You get an 80% cut and Ubdi gets their 20% cut. That's actually really generous, to be honest. Compared to other survey sites, they would never do that. So just think about it like this. In my mind, companies like Google and Facebook already have your data, and you know, they're already selling your data. So you might as well support Ubdi and take back some of that control and earn some money doing it. All right. And the last site, Fluidstack. It's unlike any of these sites. It's not a survey site. It's not an offer site. It's a passive income site. Now you're like, what? What does that even mean? A passive income site that doesn't exist. Wait, it does. With Fluidstack, you're selling your internet bandwidth. And it's the absolute easiest way to create a passive income source for anyone. One, it requires no money and two, it requires no investment of time. I earn about 80 cents per day selling my internet bandwidth. So those were the six websites. Now I'm gonna look at my earnings. And I've posted all my earnings on this subreddit that I've created called Reddit Money Smart. And I will leave a link in the description obviously for all of you to check it out. 
Now my earnings are up here on my earning report. So here it is. Here's a little table of contents. I wrote a little about me. Then my monthly earning reports are here and little short reviews on each one of these two. For December, it's winter break and it's the holidays. So obviously by the third week, it got a little slow. But as you can see, Swagbucks, I'm earning like a dollar two consistently every week. It's That's just the coupon offer. And then you see $72 this week. Like what happened, right? I completed the LifeLock offer, which paid me $80 to sign up for it. And it only costed me $9 to purchase the monthly subscription. So I made a profit of $71, obviously. Then for CrowdTap, $5 per month. This is the usual with CrowdTap. Prolific, I made 14 12 I usually make around like 10 to $15 a week just having the Prolific app open. And what helps me like get the surveys right away is actually this Chrome widget called Prolific prolific assistant it's called and whenever there's a prolific survey it'll just notify me right away so that's a pro tip prolific assistant chrome widget if you want to get the surveys right away get in there right away because there is a seat limit for the surveys and by the third week as you can see there's less oobdi this eleven dollars took me like five minutes to make Max, it's it's wild what Oobdi's doing. Uh, I check Oobdi like once or twice a day, maybe once in the morning and then sometime in the afternoon. You're usually able to earn three or six dollars every week, maybe even nine dollars if you're paying attention and you don't miss the surveys. Then I earned around twenty-three dollars from the we Weeble sign up, which is just a sign up bonus for a stock brokerage. So this is not a permanent thing. And then I earned, I earned around 80 cents every day with Fluid Stack. But here's how much I earned each week. And the total came out to be $113. And it's not the end of the month yet, but that's the total right now. And if you want to see my November earnings and future earnings I will post, for sure visit the subreddit that I will link in the description. If you want to see some signups for pay, they're right here. I think I have 20 up right now. I'm planning to put way more up. Definitely visit for that. All right, and that's the end of the video. I hope you go and try some of these websites out because they really helped me and I hope they help you. Hit that like button if I helped you out. Subscribe for some future content, maybe. And that's it. Thanks for watching.